Apple's quest to build its own 5G modem, stepping away from Qualcomm's technology, has been riddled with challenges as per Bloomberg's Mark Gurman. Despite acquiring a significant portion of Intel's smartphone business in 2019 to kickstart its modem development, Apple has faced setbacks. Supports suggest it's years away from matching or surpassing Qualcomm's five chips. Initially aiming for a 2024 launch, Apple's in-house modem now faces further delays, pushing its release to late 2025 or early 2026. The company intends to debut this technology in a version of the budget-friendly iPhone, say. However, its modem chip development is still in its early phases and might significantly lag behind competitors. Virtuous issues abound. One version lacks support for faster MUWAVE technology, while working with Intel's code has caused complications requiring extensive rewrites. Balancing new features without breaking existing ones, all while avoiding potential patent conflicts with Qualcomm, has added complexity. Critically, Apple's hardware division, managing multiple projects, is strained, making bug resolution challenging. Apple's rift with Qualcomm emerged in 2017 over alleged unfair royalties. Despite briefly using Intel chips in the iPhone 11 series, Intel couldn't meet Apple's 5G chip standards, leading to a settlement with Qualcomm. This culminated in a new contract spanning 2024-2026, covering iPhone launches amidst Apple's modem chip delays. While the in-house modem faces setbacks, Apple is adamant about ending its reliance on Qualcomm due to cost. Although the first modem will stand alone, Apple aspires to create a system on a chip, reducing dependency on suppliers like Broadcom, granting greater control over component development.